Hello YouTube. Um, in this video, I'm gonna be showing you first a free firewall. Firewalls are very useful because they block and any unwanted like viruses, spyware, malware, pretty much anything, and you can customize them pretty much however you want. All right. Um, the one I am using right now is called um, Commando Firewall. To get to it, just go to Google and type in Free Firewall, just like this, and nothing else, and just click Google search. It'll say Commando or whatever Free Firewall software download. Right, then go to download now, and it's completely free. This is not a trial version, this is free. Why free? Read this and you'll find out. Just download it, and at first, it can get really annoying because it'll ask you if you want to block everything. If you go on MySpace, YouTube, it'll ask you if you want to block that or this. So you just have to be patient with it and set it how you want. Alright, now I'm going to show you a free um, spyware and malware scanner. It's... Um, it's a it's not a trial version, but it's a shortened version of their main one. It's called Malwarebytes F um, Virus Scanner or whatever. Just type in Malwarebytes Free Download in Google. And just Google search it, and then go to Download Malware Malwarebytes Anti Malware and download it. Alright, and then, um, let's see. Okay, and this is what the icon looks like. Okay, and then you can, there's protection, like it offers test protection. Test complete, and it protects you a little. I don't really understand how, but you can also run a, um, quick scan, full scan, and you can choose what drives, and you start the scan, and it will scan your whole computer. Now, I have one more thing to show you, maybe it'll be done by then, I don't know. Okay, when you go to Google, and you type in Malwarebytes free download, to get the anti-malware, you click on the third search result. If you click on the first one, it leads you to a, a thing called Rogue Remover. I don't actually have this, I just saw this, but I want to show you guys. If you ever get a Trojan virus on your computer, mainly what it does is it will, um, like in internet options, you can set where your homepage is. It'll reset your homepage, and then it'll make it so it like downloads um, certain files that go to your main windows like programs and you can't get rid of the virus because it's attached to that program and you can't remove that program so mostly you pay a couple hundred dollars in order to remove those trojans and you don't actually get them removed because most computer places scam you or something I have yet to find a good computer place that will remove trojans and I have yet to find out how to remove it myself but um when you have a trojan and it does that there are certain websites that will automatically download a thing and down here if it looks like this for you you'll have little icons say your computer's at risk your computer's at risk well it's really annoying so if you can't get rid of the trojans but you can live with them because they're not really affecting it and you're smart enough to, to sign on to anything in the computer that they can steal your passwords because they will steal your passwords and you just want to get rid of those annoying anti-spyware and virus things that tell you they can remove it right now even though you have to pay fifty dollars you can get rogue remover for free and it has a description of it and you can download it from majorgeeks.com or download from betanews.com we'll go here first and then get the link because it'll 
direct you right to the downloading page. And also, I want to say those um, those ads that are put on your computer, they also put viruses in your computer. So you have more and more, and pretty soon you're like, okay, I'll download it and I'll buy it. And then it ends up probably not working. Right. Um, well, it's not dumb, but it's already found two malware. Malware aren't that bad. They can contain a Trojans and stuff, though. And this hasn't found that many, but for me so far, but two still infected. So after that, you just clean it or quarantine it, and yeah. All right. Um, thank you for watching my tutorial, and don't forget to rate this video.